आर यू कन्फ्यूज बिटवीन दीज थ्री मदरबोर्ड्स बी सिक्स फिफ्टी मदरबोर्ड्स एसूस बी सिक्स फिफ्टी गेमिंग प्लस वर्सेज एम एस आई बी सिक्स फिफ्टी टॉमा हॉक वर्सेज कीगा बाइट्स बी सिक्स फिफ्टी एम और एल ई दोस्त थ्री आर अवेलेबल अराउंड द सेम प्राइस कैटेगरी रेंज ऑल दीज थ्री लुक गुड एंड यू आर कन्फ्यूज विच वन यू शुड गेट और यू शुड बाय फॉर योर गेमिंग पी सी स्ट्रीमिंग पी सी और एनी काइंड ऑफ पी सी विच यू आर बिल्डिंग विद ए एम डी राइजन सेवन थाउजेंड सीरीज प्लेटफॉर्म यू नीड अ बी सिक्स फिफ्टी बोर्ड एंड इफ यू आर लुकिंग फॉर एनी वन ऑफ दीज और आर कन्फ्यूज बिटवीन दीज थ्री मदर बोर्ड डो नॉट वरी टूडे आई विल शो यू अ साइड बाय साइड कंपेरिजन बिटवीन ऑल दीज थ्री मदर बोर्ड्स ऑन क्राइटेरिया बेस सो दैट यू कैन डिसाइड विच वन इज गुड फॉर यू तो इन दिस वीडियो यू विल सी अ डायरेक्ट कंपेरिजन क्राइटेरिया वाइज बिटवीन एम एस आई बी सिक्स फिफ्टी टॉम हॉक वर्सेज एसूस बी सिक्स फिफ्टी गेमिंग प्लस टफ मदर बोर्ड वर्सेज कीगा बाइट्स और एस बी सिक्स फिफ्टी एम वाई फाई मदर बोर्ड सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द कंपेरिजन ऑल द थ्री मदर बोर्ड सपोर्ट्स ए एम टी राइजन सेवन थाउजेंड सीरीज लेटेस्ट डेस्कटॉप सी पी ओज which has socket AM5 both comes with 4 DDR5 RAM slot supporting up to 128 GB DDR5 RAM gigabyte supports up to 6666 megahertz in OC mode ASUS supports 6400 plus megahertz in overclocking mode but we will only consider 6400 megahertz for safer side Tomahawk comes with 4 DDR5 RAM slot supporting up to 128 GB DDR5 RAM. MSI claims to support RAM speeds up to 6600 MHz in OC mode, but we will take it as 6600 MHz as it's mentioned specifically in the frequency list. Gigabyte has one display port supporting a maximum resolution of 3840 pixels by 2160 pixels at 144 Hz. and one hdmi port supporting maximum resolution of 4096 pixels by 2160 pixels at 60 hertz asus has one display port 1.4 which supports maximum of 8k at 60 hertz and one hdmi 2.1 port which supports maximum 4k at 60 hertz msi supports hdmi 2.1 with hdr maximum resolution of 4k 60 hertz and Display port 1.4 with maximum resolution of 8K 60 Hz. Gigabyte has one PCI Express X16 slot from CPU supporting PCI 4.0 and running at X16 mode, and one PCI Express X16 slot supporting PCI 4.0 and running at X4 from chipset. ASUS has one PCI E4.0 X16 slot which is connected from the CPU. One PCI 4.0 X16 slot which runs in X4 mode from chipset and two PCI 4.0 X1 slots from chipset as well. B650 Tomahawk has two PCI Express 4.0 X16 slots and one PCI Express one slot. Slot one supports up to 16x from CPU. Slot two supports up to X2 mode from chipset. Slot three is a PCI 3.0 and supports X1 mode from chipset. In terms of storage, Gigabyte offers two M.2 slots. First M.2 supports up to PCI 5.0 X4 mode and X2 mode from CPU. Second supports up to PCI 4.0 in X4 and X2 mode from CPU. It comes with four SATA ports. ASUS has three M.2 slots. First slot supports PCI 5.0. X4 mode from CPU slot 2 supports PCI 4.0 X4 mode from CPU slot 3 supports PCI 4.0 X4 mode from chipset however do note that M.2 third slot shares bandwidth with PCI Express X16 second slot so the X16 second slot will be suspended once the M.2 third slot is used MSI has 3 M.2 slots Slot one and two supports up to PCI 4.0 X4 mode from CPU, and slot three supports up to PCI 4.0 X4 from chipset. It also has six SATA ports. Gigabyte has Realtek 2.5 gigabit Ethernet LAN port. However, the exact model is not known. ASUS also has Realtek 2.5 gigabit Ethernet port, but the exact model is not known. MSI has Realtek RTL 812. 5B 2.5 Gbps 
gigabits per second LAN port. In terms of audio, Gigabyte is equipped with Realtek audio codec, but the exact model is not mentioned. Also supports S slash PDIF output. Asus also has Realtek high definition audio codec, but the exact model is not known. MSI is equipped with Realtek ALC 4080 codec and supports S PDIF output. Gigabyte has AMD Wi-Fi 6E RZ616 with Bluetooth 5.2 for PCB Revision 1.0 motherboard and Intel Wi-Fi 6E AX210 with Bluetooth version 5.3 for PCB Revision 1.1 motherboard. ASUS has Wi-Fi 6 and Bluetooth 5.2. MSI is equipped with Wi-Fi 6E and wireless module is pre-installed in the M.2 key E slot. However, note that Wi-Fi 6E 6 GHz band may depend on every country's regulation. MSI also has Bluetooth 5.2. Gigabyte has two USB 3.2 Gen 2, one USB Type-C 3.2 Gen 2, four USB 2.0 and four USB 3.2 Gen 1. ASUS comes with one USB 3.2 Gen 2x2 Type-C port, two USB 3.2 Gen 2, 1 USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type C and 4 USB 2.0 ports. MSI has 2 USB 2.0, 4 USB 3.2 Gen 1, 3 USB 3.2 Gen 2, and 1 USB 3.2 Gen 2 by 2 Type C port. Talking about special connectors, Gigabyte has 1 water cooling CPU fan header, 3 system fan headers, 1 system fan slash water cooling pump header. 2 addressable LED strip headers, 2 RGB LED strip headers, 1 CPU cooler LED strip or RGB LED strip header, 1 Thunderbolt U4 add-in card connector, 1 TPM header, 1 reset button, 1 reset jumper, 1 clear CMOS jumper, 1 Q flash plus button and 1 optical SPDF output connector. ASUS has 1 4-pin CPU opt fan header. 1 4 pin AIO pump header, 4 4 pin system fan headers, 3 addressable ARGB Gen 2 headers, 1 Aura RGB header, 1 clear CMOS header, 1 Thunderbolt USB 4 header, 1 BIOS flashback button. MSI board has 1 pump fan header, 6 system fan headers, 1 tuning controller connector J dash, 2 addressable V2 RGB LED connectors. 2 RGB LED connectors, 1 TPM pin header supporting TPM 2.0, optical SPDIF out, flash BIOS button. ASUS comes with WinRare software, whereas Gigabyte does not come with a genuine WinRare software copy. MSI does not come with WinRare software. So this was the comparison between MSI B650 Tomahawk versus ASUS B650 Gaming Plus Stuff Motherboard versus Gigabyte B650M Aorus Elite AX Motherboard. All these motherboards are equipped with Wi-Fi and if you want to buy any of these motherboards, the link of these are present in the description box below which will also support the channel. If you found this comparison helpful and useful, do click on that like button if you have any doubts ask me in the comments down below share this in the pc community group so that they can also get help from this video and also subscribe the channel for more such interesting comparison between motherboards and pc builds and all pc or gaming related videos do subscribe the channel thanks for watching this video and i will see you in another comparison or rated video very soon